In this video, I will show you how to give a hint use the jQuery autocomplete. Example here, if we input box, if we type A, you will give a hint agent script, Apple script, ASP. You will get the AS and give this hint, and you can input this one. So the source code is here. So we can use the style sheet, this is the jQuery UI.CSS from the jQuery library, UI library. And we also use the jQuery library and the jQuery library here. This style sheet, it doesn't matter, it's not important yet. So the website is here. Call jQuery UI dot com autocomplete. This ex example here. Now you can enable users to quickly find and select from a pretty popular list of values. As they type, the autocomplete widgets provide suggestions while you type into the field. So the source code here. So we have a uh, use list jQuery UI library and we have function, jQuery function here. We can define a, a, a variable text. For example, we give put all the hint into this JavaScript array here. And we have a dip here. Label here, the force. This is the input, we put ID text here. So when we put the input ID here, it's autocomplete. The source is called available text. It's quite simple. So this input text should be consistent with this text, autocomplete. And this is not the this UI which kind is not important here. So okay. So let's run this script here. This is the script text, this is input text. We use a jQuery. So as we as I show here, you will type A, you give a hint action script, Apple script, ASP. Apple here. You can set this one as input. Very similar to the Google search. So in summary so we can use the Google or uh, uh, jQuery UI autocomplete list the gadget uh, widget to to do very simple search thing like uh, Google search. If you write a code from scratch by yourself using the JavaScript, you can do it, but it's very complicated. So the key things you call is the you need to call is the jQuery from the jQuery library and jQuery UI library. And you also probably need the jQuery UI.CSS. So when you type, you can show uh, the style here. So if you, you use the CSS, then you can get the style. A, if we don't use the CSS, the style is not this way. It's probably agents click on the other place. So you still need to use the style. This one is not important, this style. And this is the widget also not important here. Yeah. This widget. Even probably we don't need the input this text. For example, you still can run this Still give the hint here. So thanks for your watching. This is a video is about uh, using jQuery UI autocomplete to fill the search box. Thanks for your watching.